It's currently Monday, September 28th. I'm working on my portfolio for Architecture College, and this whole video will explain how I developed it over the course of the fall semester of senior year. I might even throw some college app stuff in, so. That's it. exciting. Um, I also can give you a quick tour of some of the things that I already have, and then we'll get into the development of my portfolio and how it all worked out. Hey there, demons. It's me, your boy. Ooh. More paints. Canvas bed. Tape. A jar. Palette bed. The palette knife was on the other side. Mm -hmm. Linseed oil. Water mixable oil paint. Very exciting. Exciting. Hello. I, uh, I have to do a painting now. It's like two hours before class. Yeah, so I have to do a painting now. It's like a Bob Ross. Of Barbara's was a dressed Indian kid, super sweaty, and has to finish a painting assignment in two hours. Yo, what is good my brothers and sisters? So basically I've been working on a lot of art and I set up two meetings with my professors <laughs> to review my portfolio before I submit my first round of schools which are uh, which require the portfolio which are the University of Oregon, University of Cincinnati, Syracuse University of Houston and I might do an Illinois Institute of Technology you don't know right now um, working on some paintings, I have my braces adjusted, so I'm feeling um, a lot of discomfort, but that will never stop the art grind. So there's this, there's my, oh my god. Okay, so this is my still life of um, just warrior's gear. It's like, you know, all the stuff that kind of represents how I'm a warrior's fan. 
I use this glazing technique to basically move like the background further into the objects are like coming more forward. Right now I'm working on a portrait of my grandmother. I haven't showed it to her yet because I'm still working on the face and ironing out the details. I also have to like draw an asari in the background with a cloth pack pattern. I'm also not happy with some of her facial features, like I said, so I have to work on that. <laughs> that's basically it actually my parents are are not home right now so i'm kind of energy so i'm gonna eat and then i'm gonna get started on some some more painting i finished all the homework and to do tip for today so don't have a lot of art i do have a lot of art i just have more time to do it right now and i went to pleasanton i have an idea for a new art project with buildings because i'm doing architecture and i don't have any pieces with the buildings in my portfolio. So I should probably get started on that stuff. So that's what it looks like right now. The, the blending in the back is kind of rough. But I think that's that's the kind of vibe we're going for. I have to fix her arm, maybe her forehead here and some other stuff. But otherwise it's pretty good, you know. Right now, I did the same thing. I laid out all my paintings together. So just adding another one to the collection, as you can see. I'm kind of bringing some new colors and that like the bright yellows and the, the warm tone of the picture and the cool piece the mix the black and white and then the warm gonna do a landscape soon that'll be next starting this week of the landscape but i did design my website so that is super cool and i will mention ponytail today the look i can't even see my reflection but i'm assuming it looks good it feels comfortable Yep. Peace out. Peace, peace out. But this is my Wix website. I made it on Wix.com. Endorsement for Wix. Uh, let's go to preview. Just show you. So this is what my site would look like. So a picture of my dad. And all of these beautiful works of art. I'm just kidding. All my pieces. If you highlight a piece, it'll show the medium, uh, the size, and the date it was completed. It's bio. I have some stuff for my college supplements. I took this picture of my chocolate wow. pencils. And then, so I did a little bit of everything. Talk about my programs, evolution of interest in architecture and that kind of stuff. Selected work. I have the, all, the, all the same pieces of work. If you hover over, short description. I have to proofread these descriptions. And sketchbook pages, just a few sketchbook pages. And my study of Abraham Lincoln. I wrote a small description right there. And this is, this is actually one of the pieces I did for my desk. I uh, looked through the different, I uh, drew some objects before actually completing it. So that's where we are right now. Hi, it's been so long since I've updated. It's currently November 4th around noon. So the election results are still coming in. Um, yeah, I don't, I don't know who's gonna win. I'm sorry if I jinxed the election. Mm -hmm. So I've been working on my architecture stuff. I've submitted seven out of my <laughs> 14, um, college applications, um, 13 on the Common App, one uh, through Pratt, Pratt has a separate application, um, and then I also have uh, the UCs and CSUs. I finished my CSU application filling all that out. So the colleges I've applied to are University of Oregon, University of Cincinnati, University of Colorado, Boulder, Illinois Institute of Technology, and I'm also applying for a um, separate scholarship there. And then I'm also applying to University of Arizona, which I was accepted into for rolling admission. Um, Arizona State, which I was also accepted into for rolling admission. 
and I applied to Barrett, the Honors College for um, Arizona. That's six. And did I mention University of Cincinnati? I think that should be um, all of the seven colleges that I applied to. And so now I'm reading the applications for the more selective ones. So the, the ones I have left are Virginia Tech, which I finished the application for. I just have to review. University of Southern California. Um, there is also Rice University, Rhode Island School of Design, and the um, Rensselaer Polytechnical Institute, and Pratt. So that's about six colleges, I think. So I have to apply to all of those. Also, I got glasses now. I'm nearsighted. Um, so I'm in an okay place for my portfolio. I gained things I've been working on. Those are the six. I feel guilty about not painting, so I might paint something here. Um, I submitted some of my work to the Rhode Island School of Design and Pratt. They said it was overall pretty strong, which I was not expecting. So that was nice, but I don't know if they're just saying that. They could just be saying that to bait me. But they said that maybe I could focus on some composition, bringing in point of view, and maybe um, trying to layer my composition. So I tried to tackle some of that. So um, with this one, I tried to provide the point of view of entering the house. This one, I layered some um, different objects that I found relevant to downtown Niles. Like this is the um, ice cream shop. So these are my paintings as they exist. I was just finishing them up yesterday, adding some extra layers. We're gonna move into portraiture for painting. And then for drawing, we're working on skulls right now. So a bit of anatomy. They also suggested I do some figure drawing maybe. So um, I have to see how I can do that. There are some online resources um, that my art professors provided me. So. Yeah, we're about halfway done the college application process, but now is when I'm really starting to get together and synthesize like all my pieces for portfolio submission. I'm also attending National Portfolio Day and a separate RISD portfolio review on the 19th. And then I'm gonna meet with my professors again to go over my portfolio with any new pieces I've done. Four day, it's been four days into November and I haven't really created any new pieces. In October, I did create like three or four pieces. So um, I'm definitely going to try some new watercolor stuff. I want to create a kind of fictitious futuristic landscape. So I have the thumbnail for that. And I also have some toned paper, so maybe I'll do a portrait or a skull or something on that kind of paper um, just to add some variety to the work in my portfolio as it stands right now. So that's where we are at right now um, and hopefully it gets better. <laughs> Thanks. So this is the January slash December update. It is the day before school starts for spring semester. I finished all my college apps. I finished the financial aid applications. So I'm basically free now. Stop the cap. <laughs> I finished up a lot of the more selective schools towards the end, um, like uh, Rensselaer Polytechnic Institute, Rice University, Syracuse University, the Pratt Institute, um, the Rhode Island School of Design. All of those schools I worked with um, a bit later. I worked on the portfolio, did a lot of paintings, um, mainly painting. I also worked on some charcoal pieces that I would include in my portfolio. Um, there wasn't much Aside from that, I did work on the RISD assignment, um, which I designed a fire safe house for. And so after I finished all those projects, I haven't really done much with my art. Right now I'm doing a little comic book, which is more of a personal project. And it isn't really anything I'm taking too seriously. So I'm just having fun with that. And aside from that, I guess that's how everything turned out. 
if I could go back and change anything about what I did, I'd probably say that I'd want to devote more time to portfolio development. I feel like mine was not um, as developed as it could have been. So, you know, um, I was a bit sad about that. I felt I could have done much better if I had more time. Like if I started in sophomore year, I only started in my senior year. And I have no idea what the schools um, that I'm considering are going to think about what I uh, put in my portfolio. So it'll be interesting to see what I get. I have gotten some decisions back from colleges. Uh, I've gotten into ASU, University of Arizona, um, University of Colorado Boulder, University of Oregon, Illinois Institute of Technology, and the University of Houston. So those are all my safeties and targets. Or there's still some more targets but now it's only targets and reaches um, so we'll see how it turns out I don't know how it's gonna turn out um, I don't I don't know why I'm holding my glasses case but that's how this year um, for portfolio development turned out it was pretty fun and I've been developing my art skills and I'm gonna continue to develop them in the classes I take this semester so until I see you next time whoever this is um, I hope you have a good life.